hey guys and welcome to telma's kitchen so today i'm going to be showing you how i made this very very yummy you know coconut chicken fried rice yeah doesn't look like fried rice because i love pepper and i added a lot of pepper so it depends on how you want your coconut rice to turn out green like a fried rice you know kind of look but then guys let me just go straight to giving the narration so this is my already marinated chicken breast i shredded it by the way and i already marinated it for three and um three hours 30 seconds yes you could leave it long the more you marinate the more the seasoning gets into your protein yes so i decided to marinate mine because let's face it i had to do other things and i was hungry so i had to <laughs> marinate it for three hours 30 seconds sorry three hours 30 minutes sorry so i am just going to um keep stirring guys if you haven't subscribed like you you know share it to somebody tap on the notification bell what are you looking for all these things i just mentioned please if you like to use crayfish just bear in mind that whatever you want to do it's your food there are some things in this video that are not necessary optional by the way you could pick what you want based on how you crave your coconut price to be like adding my vegetable oil i'm just going to um, allow it to steam get in the cold before i turn in my onion then my my garlic my ginger in this video there is no fresh garlic so i'm going to be using garlic powder so just if you have fresh garlic use yours if you have garlic powder use yours and this is the lot of pepper that i said made my coconut rice look a little bit brown like i was making brown rice but then it's just what i like to do so simple basic steps some people like to just you know make their stone creamy and i'm going to fry this pepper and this mixture with the raw rice sorry the wash by the way and i'm going to give it a nice stir you know stirring it i'm going to heat it up a bit like allow it fry like that yes you get you got me you had me allow it fry like that so this is just me stirring it like to make sure that the pepper circulates around the rice and after a while i would go in to add my cinnamon sticks yes if you have um ground cinnamon you could use that if you don't like cinnamon it's optional so <clears throat> i'm going to begin with my cinnamon sticks and my bay leaves and after a while of heating it up for at least one to um you don't want to fry it so it goes to hard so let's say three minutes maximum you would fry that but meanwhile this video is still a bit slow because i am still staring and i'm just showing you guys step to step process so this is the bay leaf i was talking about and the cinnamon sticks and if you see i just you know i'm going to be closing it allowing it to heat for a while and then i will come in with my coconut milk yes as you can see guys it's like that because i placed this milk after breaking it sure i did that you know grinding and everything and then extracting the milk for a bit i placed it in the fridge because i was not ready at that time to make it if you want to you know a simpler method you could just go buy an already canned coconut milk without going through the stress of breaking and all that and yeah i'm just going to add a little bit water see it is best that your rice over time you add water than when you add too much water and then your rice becomes soggy so at this point anytime you see me adding water just know that at that point i felt like it was necessary probably my rice was still soft or still hard rather and i would go in step by step to add water it is easier that way it is better that way than adding water and then trusting a lot so this is me adding coconut spice i already showed my ingredients so i don't need to mention them apart from the the coconut rice um flavor the salt that i'm going to be adding there is nothing extra 
and my maggie cubes by the way there's nothing extra that you won't see here so everything all my ingredients are already on this video so i don't think i need to describe oh i'm going to be adding this i'm going to be adding that let's just be that way so having mixed all my spices i'm going to heat it up like allow it to cook i had this point cut it right for christ's sake like you could normally just eat this rice if you don't really have much um vegetables to add you could just eat it like that it's already prepared so i'm going to be going in with my sesame oil yes i would have used normal vegetable oil use what you have olive oil you know sesame oil all the kind of oils you could use minus <laughs> you know you can use palm oil for this though so I'm not going to be adding literally everything my sausages my shredded chicken that was already fried um, my vegetables at this point I'm adding I added my green peppers yellow green red yes everybody knows that I like colorful food so yeah yellow green red and I'm going to be going in with my onion and my carrots so I'm just going to stir this a bit if you noticed in the video from the beginning I never added time I'm going to be adding my time at this point i'm going to be adding three maggie cubes to these um vegetables here and i'm going to stir fry it yes i'm going to stir fry it you don't want to make your veg too soft you don't want to do that because you will just kill all the nutrients so i'm going to just stir fry it for a maximum of four to five minutes on low heat you don't want your vegetables getting burnt you don't want it getting too soft so it's just at this point it was already five minutes and i needed to add it into my already cooked coconut rice just look at how beautiful this is this is coconut chicken fried rice guys there is no way you could you know look at this food and say it is only looking fine but it's not just nice trust me it's really nice and then at this point i did my own coconut flakes if you want to know how i did this coconut flakes please comment on this comment section i will just show a video on this meanwhile i made mine a little bit brown because i like that taste i like <laughs> am i nigerian i mean nigerian i like like we like bottom we like burnt a little bit burnt you know it's it says it gives this kind of flavor and all that so i haven't stepped it if you liked this video and you just crave this Please let me know in the comment section. Thank you.